Hello, my name is uh, Frank Reint. I'm a uh, assistant professor at the National University of Singapore. And I've been involved in um, a recent research publication uh, about the discovery of a new uh, species of flycatcher, a new species of bird to science. Um, birds are uh, the best known animal group on Earth. We know more about birds than about uh, any other animal groups, uh, including mammals. Um, so it may come as a surprise that every year there's still new discoveries of novel bird species happening around the world, especially in the tropical regions uh, in South America, in tropical Africa, and in Southeast Asia. Um, uh, as part of this research, my collaborators from the United States and from Indonesia, uh, as well as I, um, were uh, trying to uh, follow up on the uh, documentation of a new species of flycatcher that has not been described to science from the island of Sulawesi. In the 1990s, bird watchers uh, visited Sulawesi and found um, a flycatcher that's unknown to science, that had not been see seen there before, that could not be found in any books, and um, documented this uh, flycatcher in uh, short publications in the bird watching literature. Uh, now, the weird thing about this flycatcher is that it looks fairly similar to a migrant flycatcher from Siberia, uh, from the northern uh, parts of Asia that does winter in southern and southeast Asia, the gray-streaked flycatcher. Um, but it, it occurs in Sulawesi in the summer, and uh, there are important morphological differences uh, that set it apart from this northern uh, migratory species. Uh, so what we did is that um, all in all we uh, carried out a bunch of expeditions to the area. Uh, I was personally only part of unsuccessful visits to the area to see and find this uh, bird species. Um, but then my colleagues managed to uh, to uh, obtain a specimen in the field in Sulawesi um, just a short while ago uh, and then came back uh, deposited the specimens. Uh, we actually found two specimens in uh, the museum in um, Java, in uh, Jakarta, and uh, then went on to describe the, the new species based on these uh, specimens that we found in the field. An important part of this research was the DNA uh, perspective, because um, with uh, flycatchers, it's very important to make sure that what you describe is not just a, a population of a species that's already known because many of these flycatcher species are very cryptic. They look very similar amongst each other. So um, we compared the DNA of this new flycatcher species uh, with the DNA of all the other Asian flycatcher species of the same genus that we could get a hold of. Uh, this DNA part of the research happened in my lab here in Singapore and uh, we were able to ascertain that this new flycatcher species has a highly distinct DNA signature that's uh, unlike any other Asian flycatcher, thereby confirming that um, we are dealing with a, a genuinely new novel species of flycatcher in Sulawesi. Um, we uh, named the species Musicapa sodii, or the Sulawesi streaked flycatcher in English. Sodii refers to uh, the late Professor Nafjod Sodi from uh, the uh, National University of Singapore, who um, um, unfortunately passed away uh, a couple of years ago, um, and uh, who has uh, had great um, a great influence of uh, on many of us in terms of conservation biology. He's left a great legacy in the conservation biology field, and we felt it was appropriate to name this flycatcher after him. Um, the Sulawesi flycatcher, streaked flycatcher, is probably uh, not an endangered species. We found it in areas that are fairly degraded. We found it in secondary forests. We found it in um, uh, coffee plantations that have overgrown, uh, that are overgrown, and that have uh, old shade trees. So it, it's probably able to cope with a fair degree of habitat degradation. But uh, more research is needed in order to uh, make sure that um, its uh, population is not going down, uh, because there's rampant deforestation happening in Sulawesi, and there's hardly any uh, primary forest left in the areas where the flycatcher has been found. Um, the Sulawesi flycatcher is um, one example of several uh, new taxa that, or new species of bird that still linger in eastern Indonesia. And uh, we are confident that there are going to be more species to be found in the next few years in the same region, in Sulawesi, neighbor, neighboring islands, and also in uh, other regions of eastern Indonesia, because this, this region of the world continues to be underexplored in terms of uh, biodiversity, including birds, which are usually the best known 
uh, component of the fauna and that are usually very well um, uh, documented. Um, I guess that's, um, that's the most important things uh, about this uh, new discovery and you can find uh, more details about it in our publication in the scientific journal PLOS One uh, and a link to this publication is posted below um, this window. Thank you very much.